This tutorial is designed to teach you how to access your print archive and how to manage the settings of your print history inside of GCSS Army. Before we get into the lesson, there are some key points that need to be discussed. The first key point is that the print archive stores documents that were previously printed in the system. The second key point is that if you do not want your print history deleted, the settings have to be changed to do not delete. The third key point is that GCSS Army is driven by transaction codes. This is different from PIVAS. The transaction code Sierra Papa 02 is used to access the print archive inside of GCSS Army. From the unit supply menu, I'm going to type the transaction code Sierra Papa 02 in the command field. Keep in mind, SP02 will not be found on your unit supply menu. It's one of those transaction codes you will have to type into the command field. Also, you may notice that I put a forward slash O in front of that transaction code. Anytime you want to have multiple screens open, make sure you put a forward slash O so you can have multiple tabs open. So we press enter. And this is Sierra Papa 02. As you can see, we have the unit supply menu open as well as SP02. So we're gonna maximize this screen. And now I'm gonna click on this PDF icon so I can reprint it. In this example, we're pulling up a primary hand receipt. I'm gonna blow this up so you can see it a little bit clearer. So this is your property book. You can hit print. You can cancel or print it as needed. In this example, I'm gonna hit cancel. I just wanna show you how to use it. So now we're gonna talk about the settings. So I'm gonna click on the print icon to manage my settings and change it to do not delete. So the history of everything I print can be saved in SP02. Come down to Properties, select Output Options. As you can see, my retention period is set for every eight days. So what that means is that every eight days, the system will delete everything that I print. But I wanna change my settings, so I double click. The residence time is gonna to change to Do Not Delete. And now I want to save my default. As you can see, the retention period is set for eight days, but at the top, I'm gonna to change those parameters or copy those parameters to do not delete. So my settings for my um, print parameters are set. Copy settings. As you can see, the retention period is now saved to do not delete. Now I can continue. And if I want to show my parameters on the initial screen, I'm gonna put a check mark in the space provided. Select continue. As you can see, my parameters as on the front screen do not delete. Continue. So again, this is Sierra Papa 02. It's gonna pull up everything that you print in the system as long as it's set to do not delete. I hope you found this video tutorial to be helpful.